Hello and welcome to another episode of Minecraft Legends. In the last episode, we got this big guy, which is the first of Oak, and he is the daddy of these little things. These plant golem spawners, I believe. So I believe he must be a ranged golem. Doesn't actually say anything. In Oh, maybe it does. Maybe we have to go into this section. Uh, have we got uh, information? There we go. The first of Oak is a powerful cannon, can launch booming range attacks against the piglins. Uh, to assemble the first, you must build special improvement at the Well of Fate and collect the... Yeah, I've already done that. So, yeah, there'll be more of these kicking about in the world that we need to discover, which does mean that we kind of need to go on a journey to go and see if we can find them. Um, but I'm not going to do that right now because uh, I want to go back and smash these piglins to bits. But before we go there, is there anything else we can spend our prismarine on? I believe there was a structure... Oh, I didn't mean to do that. There was a structure in here that I think I could afford this one, Abundant Allays, which means we can have more building allays and more gathering allays. So I think it might be a good idea to build one of those over here and just spend a little bit more of our prismarine. Why not? Where's the things I've been building? Uh, over here, look. There we go. So let's, uh, let's plonk this down, I guess, next to that one if we can. Can we get it a bit closer? There we go. Let's have that. And that's going to cost us 100 stone, 10 gold, and we're nearly out of gold and 50 prismarines. So we definitely do need to destroy some more piglins. Now, it'd be amazing if I could um, build a well house over by where I'm fighting. But of course, the well houses uh, cost also 50 prismarine and a lot of resources. So I can't do that. So we're just going to go and kick some piglin butt. Which means we're going to go on a bit of a journey. <laughs> Walk all the way over there. Which is mildly annoying. Um, but yeah, hopefully we can gather some resources on the way. We're, we're very, very low on resources. So, no, wrong one. So let's get my resource gathering hot bar out. Let's grab some trees. And let's go to some of these stone things and grab a whole bunch of stone. Because we're going to need a lot of it going forward. And now that I've got more allays, I can gather more stuff more quickly. Which is wonderful. Absolutely lovely. Uh, let's grab some more trees. There we go. And that's going to give us a whole bunch more of those resources. And if we can find some more iron somewhere. Is that iron? It's hard to tell with these sh like shaders. I think it is. So we'll grab some of that. And, and we'll just help this zombie take care of these piglins. <laughs> Poor little zombie. There you go, mate. You're welcome. And here we go. I think we're just about back at the horde. See, the, this was difficulty one when we came here the first time, and now it's saying difficulty two. So I don't know if that's, like, upgraded because of things or not. But, yeah, let's just spawn a whole... I'll have one more healer. And we'll spawn a whole bunch of these guys in, and we'll go and do what we did in the last episode and see if we can't finish off taking these guys out. And there we go. We've got a whole bunch of mobs. Let's go find something to destroy, and I believe that means we're going to be headed to the inside of... Oh, I suppose you can go and get this, guys. Go and get that. That's the, like, thing that's throwing all of those rocks and boulders at us. And you're shooting totally the wrong thing. No, I, I said quite clearly this. That's it. There you go. What I want you to focus on. Let's check out... Wow. Yes, that cannon worked pretty well. That worked pretty well. So I wonder if we can also get this one as well while we're in the area. There we go. I'll take out a few of these hoglins and things. But yeah, he's doing his ranged attack is doing some serious damage, so that's good. These firsts are actually gonna change the game substantially by the looks of things. That is very ideal. Alright, everyone come with me. We're going to go do some more long-ranged attacks. If I could have a whole army of those big guys, that would be amazing. But I get the feeling you can probably only have one or two at a time. I've no idea. I might be wrong about that. But if I could... Right, we're going to get this thing as well. This is another one of these ridiculously long-ranged, throwy, boulder things. Everybody go and get that. I shall hop down here and help you take out the piglins. I don't know where they'll be my big guy. Oh, he's up there, the big guy. That's fine. And this is going to be gone in no time. Look at that. We are smashing through these things now. That was incredible. Good job. All right, we need to get out of here if we can. Hop up here. Come on, you. Oh, you were already taking that thing down. You didn't even need to tell for me to tell you to do it. Wow. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. We are making our way through this now. <laughs> All right, let's go get the big guy back if we can. We need to get out of here. Come on, chaps. 
And let's go focus on something else. Uh, oh, there's another tower over there. Let's go take that tower out. Yeah. Yeah, this, this made life a whole bunch easier. Oh, and there's one of those there as well. well. We'll take that out as well. We'll take the tower out first. Let's go go and get that, guys. There you go. Yeah, doing it from close up probably wasn't your, your best bet there, little uh, or big golem or whatever your name is. Get healed. There we go. And now do this one. That's it. Well done. I think it is safe to say you have the Horde's attention. Yeah. Yeah, they're all going to be pouring out the portal again now. But look at that. Another one down. Brilliant. Right, let's do uh, do the old off. Do the old running away thing. Come on, guys. Let's back off a little bit. Everybody back off. That's it. Good job. Let's see if we can heal up a little bit. And we'll go and get that big old nether spreader. We'll take that one out. And then we will be unstoppable. Possibly. Who knows? And then we can go get the portal in the middle. In fact, I think there's probably enough structures around now for us to actually just concentrate on the portal in the middle. Let's just do that. If you Off you go, guys. And I'll try I'll try my hard... Oh, jeez. How, how have you all ended up over here? That's not what I was telling you to attack. That. It's down to 99%. I don't know where our first... Oh, he's up there. Shooting at totally the wrong thing. Oh, good job. Uh, we have we have a total disorganised mess going on here now. That's not what, it's not what I asked you to do, is it? Not what I asked you to do at all. You're all doing it totally wrong. First guy, you're shooting the wrong thing. Totally the wrong thing. You're supposed to be helping us over... Oh, jeez. Oh, I suppose you destroyed it. Good job. Can you uh, can you come down here? Maybe? Possibly? Can you come, come follow me? No, can't reach him. Oh, she's shooting that guy. <laughs> okay. Well, that didn't quite go the way I was hoping it would. But, you know, it could be worse, I guess. I need to... <laughs> I need, uh, parkour! Parkour! Here we go. I'm out. Come on, first, dude. We need to go get some more army. Come on. I can't... Come on. Follow me. Run away! That didn't go how I intended. Not even a bit. Okay. Let's call everybody back if there's anyone left. Oh, well, there was a couple. Right, need a couple more healers. And then we just need a whole bunch of these guys. And we can go and get it. Are we nearly there? There we go. Spawned army is full. Does anyone need healing while we're here? I think we're all good. Oh, we got a llama with us. That's nice. Isn't that nice? <laughs> We've got the lovely little llama with us. Right, let's try and go in at it from an angle where they're not going to expect us, guys. Let's come up at it from this... Oh, or not. <laughs> no, this way. Run away. That was a bad idea. Run away, guys. <laughs> Yeah, they're, they're literally all on that side. Um. Hmm. Oh, there's, there's another big tower there as well. I didn't see that before. Oh, jeez. Right. Get it from this side. Go, 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 go. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Come on, big guy. Shoot the right thing. I'll do my best to protect against the piglins. I don't think I'm going to do a very good job, but I'll try. Come on. Take it down. 74%. You got this. They're all popping out of the portal. 62%. You're doing a good job. The healers are working their magic. There's a bunch of piglins up here. Can I get those guys? I don't think... I, oh, I can. I can get up there. There we go. Less than 50%. We're getting through it. Just keep on taking out these piglins. I've no idea where my big guy is or if he's doing anything. I don't feel like he is 35%. Come on. Get this down to... Oh, we've still got loads of guys left as well. We are doing a lot better here. And somehow, I don't know if they're healing me, but I, I seem to be not taking a great deal of damage either. But that's good. 
Come on. 13%. Keep going, little guys. Don't let this thing get you. I wish I could hit him. I wish I could get those. Come on. There we go. 3%. 1%. We got this. We did it. We've got a totally pointless cinematic going on. Run away, you little pests. And there we go. Kaboom. Let's go and get all that prismarine. Nice. Oh. I have even more cinematic. So the piglins in this are actually fighting the hoglins there. I wonder if they're like capturing them to, to like get them on their side or something. Because obviously they're fighting for them in the overworld. It doesn't make much sense. <laughs> Doesn't make hardly any sense at all. <laughs> prismarine, please. A little bit of prismarine there. Oh, well done, guys. Look at the, what a good job he did. I think that's it. I think that's all the prismarine we're going to get. Something dangerous stalks the nether, biding its time. Soon, I fear, it will hunt you. Yeah. Of a hunt. These piglins are relentless. They never give up the chase. Yeah, I don't think we're going to get any more prismarine from any of that. What's this over here? Oh, there's, was that gold? Did I miss things that give you gold? Okay. So the these other structures that I didn't think we could destroy looks like they're full of gold. So I could have picked up a whole bunch more gold. The, the, the items just despawn so quickly. <laughs> but yeah, we've still got a bunch of army left from that. What a good job we did. Excellent. So on the map then... Yeah, we're down to two of these things over here. Two of those things over there. So I guess the next one will be the horde of the spore that we need to go over to. And now we've got a little bit more prismarine. Let's hop back home. Let's uh, call our army back. So they're not all just left out in the wilderness. And let's head over towards that thing that we're going to be doing next. Um, where's my little spawners? 105 prismarine, which is either one sort of decent building or two small ones. I kind of... Um, kind of want to save some of my stuff so I can build a well house over here so I don't have to keep walking back to it. But I also want to build the stuff that's over here and with the prismarine being so difficult to just get hold of like this uh, let's go into this. What could we build that we don't have? Uh, we don't have the ability to get diamonds or cure netherrack. Uh, improvement banner. Uh, each additional improvement adds 15 plus mobs that can rally around you. So that would be really good. However, we really need these ones before we can do that. So I need, look at that, 200 prismarine for that one and 25 gold. And we're nowhere near that. So I don't think I'm going to spend any. Maybe I'll spend 50 when we get over there and on a well house. And then, um, then hopefully by the time we've taken these piglins out, we'll be able to afford that other one as well and actually be able to spawn in more mobs because the more mobs we can spawn in the better we can well the more we can achieve right i want a bit of wood while we're on our way please my little lay friends if you wouldn't mind and i'd like a little bit of stone while we're on our way as well and if i find some iron a little bit of iron would be good as well but i kind of feel like uh Early on in this, I've kind of wasted a lot of the prismarine we got on stuff we didn't need. Visit the village chest to see what they brought you. No. Oh, I guess you get gold and stuff from that, but no. <laughs> no, I'm busy. <gasps> oh, what's that? Oh, that's where we're heading, isn't it? No, that's a different one we're heading to. That's a different one. So we're going over to this one here. Okay. I was hoping we might pop across some more of these like firsts just kicking about somewhere but it doesn't look like we are that's an interesting looking trick they add such cool things into these games that are just not in normal minecraft it would be it would be really nice to see these things cropping up in normal minecraft right okay so we're gonna put a well house down over here put it down where there's plenty of resources i guess 
in this area, so we don't have to keep walking all that way back. Let's pop it down here. We can? Can we put it down? No, we can put it in a tree, but we can't put it on the ground, of course. That makes perfect sense. Right, let's uh, let's knock down the trees first. No? Can I get any iron? I can get the iron, but I... What? Oh, because I've got too much wood already. Okay. Okay, right. Okay, that's... In that case, I don't want to put it too close to these guys. I don't want them... Uh, like, that's really close to those guys. Although this is a very small little camp. Doesn't even have a portal at it, so... Is a well house actually a good thing to put over here? Maybe not. Maybe we should put it in between the other ones. Because we're going to be heading over to the other ones as we progress in this area. Where are the other ones? There's, there's that big one up there, I think. I feel like we already took that one on, didn't we? Is that the one we took on earlier? Have I come to the wrong place? Hmm. Oh, wait, yes, I have come to totally the wrong place. How have I managed that? Huh. Oh, well, in that case, we're not going to put a well house down here. We're just going to take these guys out, because it's only little, this thing. Let's, um, let's grab ourselves a spawner, call the troops over, and take this thing out. How hard could it be? What could possibly go wrong? No, 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 recall. That's it. And then... Oh, where's my big guy? Why didn't it recall the big guy? Oh, man! Oh, that sucks. Open the cage! Let out the badgers! Good job. Everybody attack the nether spreaders. I'll, I'll take on these pathetic little piglins. You know, when I said everybody take on the nether spreaders, guys, that means you as well. Not just, like, pick and choose who wants to. It means everybody, okay? All right, you guys, let's take on this spawner. No, 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 no. You're, you're all ignoring me again. The spawner here, this one. That's it. Goodness me. Bunch of morons. Why are you two still over here? This. This. There we go. That's that job done. Right, then, then you can get this one. Get the tower because it's shooting you. No, it's fine. Don't worry about it, mate. Wow, you see the cracks it put in the ground there? I've not seen that before. No piglins. Here we go, that's that one down. Tower next. And while you're doing that, I'm going to go and open that cage. Get rid of this little chap here if I can reach him. There we go. Open this cage. Let those badgers out. Hello, little badgers. Oh, look at you all running away. So those things must be the things that gather the gold then. So can... Oh, I can attack that. I didn't think it would let me attack that before. So do we get just get gold by getting those? Because there was loads of those around the other thing. We do look. I could have had loads of gold. Oh well. I'm a moron. What what don't we know? That's it, guys. Don't worry about getting shot by that thing. Wow, that was easy. Okay. Uh, everybody attack that. If you wouldn't mind. There we go. Good job. Where are you going? Don't stop. There we go. Wow. Now that was good. We've destroyed an outpost. Excellent. Right. Where are we moving to next then? We need to go in totally the opposite direction and actually go towards the thing that we were going towards. Which, it makes sense if you think about it, guys. It totally makes sense. We're maxed out on all of our resources. We've pretty much got all of the iron and coal, uh, iron and wood that, geez, stone and wood that we meet, need. That means the piglins will be at their worst. Keep an eye on the villagers. The piglins expanded a base. And every time they do, the more their danger grows. Really? Where's getting attacked now? Nowhere. Forget it. I don't care. <laughs> I can't just go wandering off to the, the village the villages every time the piglins decide they're having a moment. Tough. Just give me a bed so I can sleep through. Ah! tonight why why does the mouse do that sometimes why am i going in the wrong direction wow see that like how the mouse is flicking round i'm not doing that 
It's just just becoming ridiculously oversensitive at points. It's really bizarre. The sensitivity on gee, I don't stop it. I just want to go in this direction. Yeah, it doesn't. Keyboard and mouse. This game is not optimized for keyboard and mouse at all. I thought that was going to be the best way to play this because it's an RTS, and generally speaking, RTSs require lots of buttons, require lots of you know precise mouse mouse movements. Um, but no. Keyboard. I think controller is probably the way to go for this game. I've heard a bunch of other people saying they've tried it keyboard and mouse and then ended up doing it on controller and having a much better time with it. And just with this sensitivity issue alone, I can see why. I can absolutely see why. Okay, here we are at the next area where we're going to be taking on some of the nasty piglins. They have a raised up bit at the top. They've got a lot of stuff around there. Hmm... Okay, let's. We need to think about where we can pop down a little base for ourselves, and I guess somewhere where we don't have to wander over too far. Ideally, oh, will you clear off? Smelly piglins. Some iron here that could be a useful. Yeah, this could be a useful spot to have our our fountain, but it does depend on how close we are to the other piglin things as well. Because I don't want to. Yeah, we're kind of in the middle of those two, so I think this is good good spot for the fountain. Oh, and I can actually build it here, so that's useful. Let's put some of the defences around it. Let's pop ourselves a spawner down. If I can find the right button for the spawners. That one. There we go. Um, again, we're just going to have that spawner and one of those spawners because I don't see any point in the other mobs at all. And I would really like it if I could get my big guy back. I don't know why he's not coming back to us. Well, now we've got a well house here, and what I can do is I can tell all of these guys here to just focus there. Like, just just wander over there. That's it. Just stand there. I'm going to go back without you to there. I'm going to get the big guy, and then I'm coming back. There. There he is. Oh, see, you're here. Why didn't you come with me? Right. You're part of the team again now. Are you going to come with me? No. Yes, now you come in with me. Excellent. Good. So now I can fast travel back there and he should come with me. Here he is. <laughs> I didn't think he was going to do it then, but he did. He came. Excellent. All right, everybody. Everybody huddle. We're going to need a bridge. Oh, no, we don't need a bridge. We can go around the side here. Oh, this is good then. Right, we don't want to go too far in that direction, but we do. We're probably going to need a uh, one of these to get up there. Oh, hang on a minute. Fourteen. The horde of the spore are perhaps what antithesize our overworld the most. They are chaotic, noxious, and without reason. No, little fox. No, don't go that way. No. Run away, little fox. Not the fox, no! Oh, right. That is it. It is going to be so particularly we unpleasant for oh, these here. piglins. You have something particularly useful to combat this base. Take Do a I? look at the melody to build the redstone launcher. Oh, you you want me to do a redstone launcher over here, do you? Why can't I build that down to there? That's dumb. Hmm. Uh, redstone, I guess I could, but then I, I I couldn't build it over here because you're not allowed to build on these bits. See, I can't put anything down on here, so it'd have to be a real long distance away. Remember, and I, your redstone launcher will help in the fight against these piglins. Well, it won't, because I can't, I can't use it over here. It's... I haven't got the ability to get rid of the spore the stuff yet. Really agitating the piglins. And uh, I also don't have the ability to... Um, yeah, I, oh jeez, falling down. I don't have the ability to extend its range or firepower, so I don't think the redstone launch is going to be the best option for us at this moment in time. Actually, it won't, because I can't put it anywhere. Now, <laughs> there we go. One down. Gather the troops. Come on, chaps and chapettes. Go and kill this spawner. And I shall try and deal with the piglins. Oh, God. Are you guys just not going to play? Okay. I'll do it on my own. 
Where's my big guy, guys? There. Hey, yeah, 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 yeah. No, no hitting the big guy. You're not allowed to die, big guy. I need you to. You're too, too important to me. Right, you guys did that. Well done. Come on, big guy with me. Right, let's see if we can get up there and get those smashy things. Smashy things? Yep, yeah, what it is, it's a smashy thing. Can I build stairs down to this? But why? Why can't I build them down to here? What's the point? I can build them onto that tree. <laughs> That's really useful. Can I, can I build them now down to the ground? <laughs> Thanks, game. <laughs> Come on, guys. Take out the big smasher. Why are you shooting over there? Well done. Good job. Good job. Right. Don't go away. We're doing this one next. And then we're going to do that one. Well done. We got the gold. Big guy. Can you please go and do as I ask? Thank you. Well done, guys. Everybody did such a good job. I'm very impressed with you all. Now, I need to find a way to get up to that one over there and get that, get rid of that big smashy thing. So maybe I'll have to build down onto an, yet another tree. Use a redstone launcher. I'll use your redstone launcher in a minute, mate. All right, can I build it, build it onto that tree there? <laughs> it makes perfect sense if you think about it. Really? You're not gonna you're not gonna let me click up there, please? What? There we go. Building this game, it worked it worked good. Go on this way. Don't get stuck. Please don't get stuck. Come on. Just come up here. Unless you're getting attacked again. Where? Why are you all going over here? Oh, your pathfinding sucks. Well, hopefully those guys all managed to do it on their own. No, they haven't. All right, come on. That's it. Up the stairs. Oh, they're all getting mullered because you guys didn't bother to come with them. There we go. That's it. There we go. Nice. Excellent. Okay, we're getting through this base. Now we need to get, ideally... Wow, you've got a very long range on you. We'll just stand here and let him just take those guys out. Just stand here. Can they hit back from over there? Are they hitting us from over there? I think they are. But he's doing a good job. Yeah, so there's a lot of high ground on here. Again, yes, the redstone launcher would be very useful. But in order to put a redstone launcher down, what I need is a the thing. Which one is it? One of the things that you can build allows you to get rid of the nether stuff. And I haven't got it yet. Uh, which one is it? No, none of those. I'm sure one of these things allows you to, like, yeah, that one. Enables you to gather relays to come. So I don't think I've built that yet. Enables gather relays to convert another rack to a safe block. You, yeah, I really don't think I've got that. Although I do have enough to build that now. So perhaps, chaps, we should go and build that. But then I still don't have the range thing. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. You all come over here. Just pop yourselves down there if you wouldn't mind. Thank you very much. I'm going to just nip home, because there's no point in building it here. I might as well build it at home. I suppose I can build it anywhere. It doesn't matter, but I'm going to build it at home. Not the redstone launcher, but the, the LA thing. Okay, uh, let's go to our building menu. Let's grab that one. Oh, I've already got it on my hotbar, so let's build it. That one. Probably turns out I've already got it somewhere anyway. I don't think I have. So let's pop this down here. Have I got that already? Is that this one? 
No, that was abundant delays, wasn't it? Does it tell you what they are? Improvement, abundant delays, yeah, so they want this one. Cure Netherrack. The delays can cure our land of this nether infection. They just need the right inspiration. And now that inspiration is just a few notes away. So I should be able to play a mel melody to get rid of those, so that's good. Uh, and I would really, 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 really like these ones. What do I need for that one? 200 Prismarine. Jeez. Yeah, nowhere near that now. Because <laughs> I've just built that. Okay, let's head back over here. And let's see how we can clear this netherrack then. So I'm assuming... Yes, there's a button. Your netherrack. Excellent. Oh, this is good. Right, where's my, um... Where's the bad guys? Where's the bad guys at, guys? You all wait there a minute. I want to see if I can, on this hill, <laughs> which is the closest one we've got to where the bad guys are, if I can cure the netherrack up here in a big... No? Can't be built on this type of terrain. What type of... T oh, so you have to do it nearby. Okay, well, let's pop one down there, then. The LA's are eager to start healing the world. And it's not the slowest process. So I guess then you can expand that further and further forward. How big of an area do they do? Can I can I keep spamming it down? I guess so. Do more. This could be a very slow process. Just want to get it up the top of this hill. <laughs> Keep going. Little bit at a time. We're near, you're getting there. You're getting closer. Is that turning that tree into not a netherrack tree? No, it's not, is it? Okay. More. Is it going to go up the side of the hill? It got rid of that tree. It is? Yes, it is. Okay, good. Aha! The genius no-tail strikes again. Come on, I need you to get it right to the top of here. Can you not reach the top? Oh, really? Is it just levelling off at the bottom? Oh, man. Okay. Well, all right, then. I'll put a bit on there. Is it costing me anything to do that? I don't think it is, is it? No, it's just costing me a laze. That's fine. Come on. And there we go. We've, we've now reached the top up here. Brilliant. And then we can make redstone cannon up here. Well, they probably can't afford it. How much is redstone cannon? Uh, let's. Um, in order to do this, we really need the spyglass thing, which I can't build yet, and the and that one. Put it there. How expensive is it? A hundred redstone. I can afford it. Ooh. Maybe it's not so bad after all. Just finish off this area, would you? Oh. Yes, I can build it up here, but will it be able to reach? It can it can reach a reasonable distance. Be nice if I could actually see. Why have you left bits out? Goodness me, a laze. Useless. Don't know why I employ you. So that's going to... So you can just about see over in the distance how far that thing can reach. Which is a reasonable way. But if you get the spyglass thing, it will go even further. Now, I don't have the spyglass thing, fortunately, and I can't even build it yet. So I'm probably going to need a couple of these. So I think it would actually be better to build it up on that area. So what I might do is just concentrate on getting these out a lays to just spread more of their goodness closer and closer in, see if we can get up that hill, and then build it on on there. But look at the area done, it look nice now, the LA's done such a good job, what a good job you've done LA's. Come on, keep spreading. Keep spreading. You got this, ow. And then if we can get a staircase up to the top of here, we are in it to win it. Yep, there we go. Look, we can... Ah. Assuming we don't get too close to their nether spreaders. Ow, I'm taking a lot of damage. Right, I need some stairs. 
Uh, can I put stairs up here? I can. Can I bring them down to here? No. Why? It's just a little bit too far. It's not. Where, are, where have I gone? Why can't I put stairs there? Maxed height. <laughs> What's the point? How am I supposed to get up there then? Oh, can I get them across? Oh, jeez. To here? Can't the space here is occupied? No, it isn't. Okay. <laughs> jeez. Why, why, why build the terrain like this and then not allow you to actually be able to scale it? That doesn't make any sense. Oh, my LAs can't quite reach up to the top of there either. Oh, that sucks. That sucks. Okay, what if we have that there down across to here? Okay, we can do that. Get some of my more nether spreaders on this bit and we maybe we'll put a redstone thing over here. Because it looks like the ones that worked over there didn't actually reach the top of those cliffs. Which is really useful. Hey guys, just popping in, see if you've got any grass around here I can uh, work from. Doesn't look like there is. I might have to take out a couple of these buildings before we do that then. I just don't want to build my redstone cannon all the way back there and not actually be able to do anything with it. It seems a bit silly. Okay, I need to, I need to make a retreat. Quite a hasty retreat. Jeez. We got this. I think that one's probably a better place to do it, although from here I could probably reach more. I don't know. I really don't know. Now that I've made easy access for them to get down there, that's perhaps not the best thing. Um, Will, have you got enough range? You've got enough range to hit something. So just spread this bit here. go back into our book. How far can these things reach? Let's swap out that and let's swap out that. How far can those scatter towers reach? Oh, not very far at all. Is that hitting anything? Oh, it is shooting that. Slowly but surely it's hitting that building. Okay. That's good. <laughs> hmm. How oh, the tables have turned, piglins. Wow, there's a lot of you guys coming over here. Enjoy a scatter tower. See how you like those apples. Don't just walk off the bridge. I'll put that there so we can get you. Hey, don't cheat. Oh, I've run out of wood. You <laughs> don't need more wood. <laughs> Quick, more wood. Gather all the woods, guys. Oh, and there's some iron there as well. I'll take that. Right, okay. We've made a reasonable number of progresses in this episode. Unfortunately, it is the end, and in the next one, we are going to build a redstone cannon and demolish some piglins. And while I am in between episodes, I'm just going to go around and gather a few resources just to top up our bank account, and I'll be with you all in a couple of minutes. Goodbye.